today, but I want to share a story with you. This professor was working with new teachers, and they were seniors in college, and right before they were going to be assigned to their school to do their long-term um, teaching, he had them shadow a student at that school. And so every single one of his seniors in college was assigned their school and given a child to shadow all day long. And they had to come back and report to the rest of the group what that day was like. And so they went out, and this one, one of his students was assigned to a high school, and her student that she shadowed every day was a 15-year-old girl. And they all got back into class. And he had read all the papers, and he asked her to share with the rest of those seniors becoming teachers what she had experienced. And she could barely talk, and she started choking up. And she said, I shadowed this sweet 15-year-old girl all day long from first period to the end of the day. And she said, there wasn't one single student or adult in that building that said a word to her all day long. And by this point, tears are coming out of her eyes. And she said, how is that possible that a child can go through an entire school day with zero interaction from a peer or an adult in that building? And I share that because I'm hoping that you'll go back and you'll spend some time, if you're an administrator or if you're a teacher, whatever your position is, looking at how are we doing in our building to make sure that there's not a child in our building, whether they're this big or this big, that ever goes through a day without a really deep human connection 